It's really, really exciting to see it all uh, kind of get worked out like this. is what is popping gang it is tuesday morning your boy has just woken up clearly about to head downstairs get some coffee and we're gonna take the day from there the same time as having breakfast i'm posting new vlogs onto facebook my laptop got my coffee got my notebook it is now time for me to not even do writing but to start editing and polishing off my book i'm going to be doing two 20 minute sessions per day of this it's time to do the first one i'm extremely extremely excited about this process so this is just kind of making sure all the wording is correct spacing is correct the structure of the book is correct etc that's what i'm going to do i'm literally sitting down i'm going to be drinking the coffee of course and getting started i just want to show you guys this so if this is my website here matt ross uh, official.com and if you go on to here where it says products and services I have literally just updated this there we go so now it says books if you click on that you'll see over here I've now listed the first book I've ever written Instagram micro influencer how to be a successful one just a short description which is yeah practical methods on how to become a successful micro influence in your industry about a career and life around something you love and then I've decided on the price it's gonna be 180 Rand for the Kindle for the audiobook and for the paperback hardcover I still need to find out because I'll be back ordering those and then just also just putting here on sale from the 31st of may so that everybody knows as well as then the book uh, cover which is really really exciting that this is all loaded up now this is kind of the overview that i've been working on so you've got the cover you've got the title there's going to be a dedication there you've got all your chapters then it starts breaking down into all of the content but being able to see it like this and look through all of these pages and everything that has been established and try and get the structure it's just so fucking surreal as you can see clearly headed out now gonna go get some coffee with family that's beautiful freaking weather out here so it's really really nice to be out when i get back later i've got more editing to do more working on the book a whole bunch of other work Here's the update pack. So I've been pushing, uh, or at least been trying to push ticket sales for the workshop happening on the 1st of June. I have got that done now. It's time for some food. And then I need to, oh, I also edited the new vlog, which you would have seen. It's also been uploaded onto YouTube. It will get uploaded onto Facebook when I release the next five this coming Sunday. So that's been amazing. Coffee was great. Everything's going really, really well. I'm gonna have some lunch and then I need to do the next task. I don't even know what that is, whether that is continuing to edit and polish up the book or whether that is a new piece of content, I will let you know. But right now, let's Let's get some food. Next thing I'm working on is to place more content into the feed. That is what the feed is up until that post there currently. All of that other stuff is new content that I would like to work into it. <laughs> This is the part of the episode where I answer one question which has been sent in by you guys. And today's question comes in from Rab T and he says, let me get this right because it's quite a long one. Besides daily posts, what other frequent actions must be taken to grow as a micro influencer? It's a phenomenal question. One that I actually cover a lot on and I'm going to plug it in here in my book that I wrote that literally the whole book is about being a successful micro influencer. Please do get that. I know that I'm plugging that in shamelessly, but I, if I didn't feel it would have value, I wouldn't say it. Quickly to rattle off a few of the things that you need to do to grow as an influencer. Influency. Apart from posting every single day, you need to interact with your audience, you need to give back, you need to collaborate, you need to do paid featured posts on feature pages, you need to do free feature posts. Uh, post on feature pages by DMing them, giving them good content, and then letting them post it. You need to be using hashtags is a very, very important one. So many people don't use their 30 hashtags. You need to be tagging people. Yeah, I think those are the few main like, and then just be like resilient. So many people want to just become boom famous overnight and it takes time. Why the fuck are you doing it? You need to have a reasoning. And then once you've got the reasoning that allows you to have the dedication and the longevity that you need in order to succeed. So it's a great, great, great question. It's like a whole video. It's like a whole hour long video on how to to do that um, I would also recommend is take a look there's a playlist on my YouTube channel and on my Facebook page called Matt Ross keynotes I think it's called take a look at that because that's got all the workshops I've ever done the full workshop so you can watch it completely for free 
where other people have paid to come to the workshop and that covers a lot of it as well. So Rabti, a big thank you for asking that. I really do feel it's gonna add a lot of value to people. Then before we end this up, if any of you have any questions at all, you know what to do. Comment that down below. Remember, I'm choosing one of these to answer every single day. Back to the episode. <laughs> Just finished up planning content and sending a few emails. All admin is done for now. It's time to change, go to the shops and then go and smack a session. Tuesday night at the Sweat Palace. Let's go. Another huge session in the bag, huge. Home from gym, have just had a shower and not wasting any time at all. I've got some BCAA, where is it? Uh, over there, 10 milligrams of BCAA with some water. I'm gonna have that while I start working on some new content. Importing files for the next piece of micro content. And right over there, we have it exporting. I was able to post on Facebook and Twitter, but for some reason, Insta Instagram is glitching again and not allowing me to post videos. So I'm moving on. You can see all the slips over there. I need to update my financials now, which is what I'm gonna do, my income statement and my long-term taxation account. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll check in with you a bit later. It has just ticked over on to 11 p.m. I haven't done my second 20 minutes of editing of the book. That's what I'm gonna do right now. I managed to complete all my financials, I'm supposed to be dealing with some emails, making really, really, really good progress on the work that I want to. Kind of the final thing I need to do before I can get some sleep is to uh, knock out the second bit of editing. So I'm going to put my head down, I'm going to focus and let me knock this out the park. Done and you can see that it's progressing really nice, nicely. You've got the cover page, breakdown there, dedication, chapters, and it goes into the first kind of main section, subsections. It's really, really exciting to see it all uh, kind of get worked out like this. It's fast closing in on midnight, I think as I cut it to midnight now, so 11.45. Um, I managed to do that. Editing the book is coming along so nicely. There's uh, still more I have to do. And I'll work on it over the next few days, but yeah, making some extremely good progress. This is where I call it night. It's time for me to head upstairs and get this crazy ass here to bed. Guys, I wanna say a big thank you. Thank you for watching this. Thank you for your attention and thank you for your support. I'll catch each and every one of you beautiful mad attackers in another 24 hours. Guys, go hustle, go grind, and I'll see you then. Peace.